Welcome everyone to Inspirational Poems by Betska the Guru Coach. I'm going to be reading two poems today that dovetail, and I'm sure you're going to see uh, how they dovetail. The first one is called Lost in the Wilderness. How many of you have ever felt you were lost in the wilderness? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Here we go. Lost in the Wilderness. In the distance is the cry of a soul lost in the wilderness. Not the forest type, but the wilderness of the mind. They constantly abuse themselves with bad food, drink, and such. Possessions are more important than love, and they seek power over others. I ask you all, where have we learned this way of life. What has happened to the simple life? What has happened to charity? Coaching brings us to that place where self-love is present every day, where the ice in our heart melts to reveal a very special being, a real leader. Powerful poem, huh? Next, I'm going to read to you a poem called, I Found My Heart. And it shares with us the value of Mind Kinetics coaching for life coaching, executive coaching, business coaching, health coaching, whatever you wish. And again, it's a poem about me. The last one was how I was lost in the wilderness. And this is a poem about no longer being lost in the wilderness, but finding my heart. So here it goes. The poem is entitled, I Found My Heart. I weep, for I left my heart behind at a time long ago when someone hurt me. I permitted them to hurt me, for I was weak and unable to stand for my own truth. I am sad, lost, fearful, and untrusting. Can you help me find my heart? I want to be strong again and yell silently from the rooftops that I am a powerful genius human being, that I am loving and beautiful and handsome all in one. For I am a mix of beauty and brawn. Yes, please coach me. That was my plea to my first coach, Jan Sweeney Remington. And two weeks later, after she had coached me, and subsequently after I learned how to coach myself, because Jan taught me many, many tools, and since then, as Betska the Guru Coach, I've developed over 80 uh, coaching and self-coaching methodologies to help people around the world. But after Jan coached me two weeks later, then subsequently for many months and many years after that, here's the result. My heart now beats like a well-tuned drum. It has found its way back home. I vow never to lose it again. I vow to sing and dance and love and be loved. I am heart. So, you know, when I look at these statistics in Canada anyway, I don't know what they are in your country or your city, but 40% of women have been abused in their lifetime. By men or women, there's abuse can come from all angles, yes? And many men have been abused and children have been abused. And you look in many countries where men and women are raped continually. And you look at our workplaces where people think nothing of hurting others because they want the glory, they want the power. So perhaps when you heard me reading my poem, 
you felt that you lost your heart because someone hurt you. Well, I'm sharing with you that as an executive coach, a life coach, business coach, health coach, I can help you to find your heart again. And so can the hundreds of uh, people around the world, thousands of people around the world who are using mind kinetics coaching methodologies because they really heal hearts. So we welcome you to come and uh, read more in The God in Coaching, the key, to, to the key to a Happy Life, because there are many stories in here. There are many tools in here that will help you to find your own heart. And uh, to order it, you can go to www.coachingandleadership.com. Thanks for being here with me today on Inspirational Poems by Betska the Guru Coach. See you soon. God bless you. Bye for now.